Hey, what's going on everybody? I'm going to show you guys how to do a tutorial video on how to fix crashing on Fallout 3 for usually Windows 10. I'm not sure if it doesn't on Windows 8, but I think it may. Anyways, so you know, when you hit play and the data files, the play, you know, the little mini screen comes up. Uh, and you'll hit play and it'll just crash. The game won't even load for you. That's all it does. And it's kind of a bummer because, you know, Fallout 3 is a fantastic game and I love it, but they really need to get this shit together when it comes to Windows 10. So, that's where I come in hand. I think that's the same. Anyways, so I'm going to show you guys how to fix it for Windows 10. Now, if this doesn't work for you, sorry. Um, maybe a different issue, but it worked out fantastic for me. And I'm going to give all the credit to a YouTube uh, channel. I'm not sure who it is. I can't remember his name, but I'm going to put his channel in the description below. Please give him the love, not me. I don't deserve it. I'm completely just putting exactly what he said in my video. I just want to get it out there as much as I can to help out more people. Anyways, so what you're going to do is you're going to go into... You're going to right-click your Fallout 3, Game of the Year, Properties local files and then you know get your files you can also do this by going through your steam steam apps common I put it as steam shit because I put it into a different folder but or a different uh, uh whatever anyways so what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on fault launcher don't double click it just right click it properties you go to compatibility so what you're gonna do is you're gonna run this program in compatibility mode for Windows XP service pack 3 and then you're going to run this program as administrator. That's all you have to do for this. Okay? So then go to fall3.exe and do the same exact thing. Compatibility, Windows XP Service Pack 3, and run this program as administrator. That's all you have to do for this. Okay? So then just close that when you're finished. Oh, wait, my bad. I lied. Go back. Go to follow underscore default dot ini. Then hit Control F and look up B U S E thread and just keep hitting Find Next and make sure the direction is on down. If it doesn't work for you, well, good luck finding this. Go all the way down until it says cannot find anymore. Okay, so it's right here B U S E thread thread did A I. This will be a zero for you right here. You're gonna change that to one. Make sure to change this to one, and then after that, you're gonna put another space below, and you're gonna copy and paste this right here. You're gonna copy and paste that right under it. I'm gonna put this into the description to make it easier for you, and then once you've done that, just save it, and then you can leave. Okay, and then after that, I'm gonna link it in the description. You're gonna download, or I'll just, I guess I could just show you. Windows Gaming, Windows for Gaming Live. Okay, I have a Windows 10, so it doesn't really matter. It'll say Windows 8, uh, Windows 8.1 right here, but you can also do it for Windows 10. Don't listen to this, this is stupid. So click here, and this little, uh, this little setup will come on. So just do all this. I'm not gonna do it because you know, I've already done it. So just do all that, but you don't have to launch it after that. It'll say launch, so just cancel out after that. That's all you have to do. And then that's it. Your game will work. So it'll pop up weird. It'll say this app might not work correctly, but it does. Here, I guess I could show you. Let's see if I can, woo. Let's see if I can get a game capture in here. Let's, I apologize if it doesn't pop up, but I'm, I'm trying my hardest. Are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck? Oh, it worked. Let's see, here you go. I don't know why it didn't work the first time. That was probably just my stupid computer. Anyways, yep, yeah, see it works. And there you go. Now that was an absolute fail, but well, at least you know it works. I think it popped up for you. It should have. Anyways, thank you for watching. 
Um, hope this works for you. I'm going to give all the credit to the guy that really did this. So, 